What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to my Minecraft survival series. So, for those of you who possibly didn't watch the the previous part because of the uh, the glitchy mic issues, um, on the last part, I created my nether farm. Most of it looks just about done. I kind of fancied up the floor here in this brewing room, and did I add these extra brewing stands on the last part? I can't remember. Well, they're they're there now. And I also uh, put uh, andesite blocks here in this enchanting room just to spice it up a little bit. And I tamed a donkey, and his name is Jim Bob. So, um, yeah. And as you can see, I did a lot more fishing while I was gone. And as you can see, I caught two more enchanted bows. What do these things have on them? Power 4 on Breaking 3, and Punch 1 in Power 4. That is crazy. I have two god bows going on here. I'm gonna probably combine these two as well. And I'll probably just keep them separate because to combine them would probably cost a lot. It's got like all the enchantments anyway. It's got these two bows have like the same exact enchantments as the other two that I used to make this one. So that's that's really insane. Let me just keep these in there along with that. And as you can see I caught um, a couple saddles which is crazy. Let's see. I think I'm just gonna put my uh Saddles, I don't really need too much, so I'm just going to put that in there. Do, can I put the sticks with some other ones? Yes, I can. I like to stack all my stuff, you know, save some room. There's some string that I can put. Do I have any string, or did I... Is there any string in this? I don't see any. Oh, well. Uh, string. Okay, and a couple bowls, and I'm just going to put my fishing rod back. I'll repair it in a little bit, or should I just... No, I don't have uh, two string. Is it nighttime? It's nighttime. Maybe you know what I want to do? I want to go try to find another string because I want to repair that bow a little bit. So, you know, let's, let's go find a spider to kill. Alright. Let's see. I don't have. I'll just eat the raw fish if I have to. Uh, that uh, reminds me. Is it on easy? Um, no, it's not. Okay. There we go. Gotta make sure it's on easy. Alright. Now let's try to find a spider. Shouldn't be too hard. I see one off in the distance. Let's just go with that one and hope it drops some string. Come at me, come at me. Oh, I almost pushed into that hole. Yeah, die. Die, stupid spider. Oh, hi, oh, hi. Little baby zombies. It's kind of lagging a little bit, but, you know, it's, it's fine. Did it drop any string at all? I don't even think it dropped any string, so, you know, I'm not going to bother with going down there. Oh, hi, other little baby zombie. Whoa, it's lagging. As you can see, the game is kind of freezing. Holy Jesus, what is going on in the game? Oh, no, oh, no. That's never a good thing. See, just just beat it down, just beat it down, yes. Okay, that's that's not good. I really don't know what is up with this uh this thing. It's lagging quite a lot. But um let's let's try to find a spider that will actually drop some string. This is getting crazy, man. Alright, there's a spider over there. There's a couple spiders over there. But no, we gotta we gotta do this, man. Alright, I should, probably should have brought some uh actual food with me. Let me just kill a pig and then eat it or something. I like cooking in the meantime. Okay, all right. It's not lagging so much now, except for that it's freezing. The game is freezing. Not really uh, FPS lag. The actual game and all the entities are lagging. That kind of unfortunate lag. All right, there we go. I got a string, so now I'm going to go back just in time as the sun is about to rise. And... Yeah, just, there's that creeper, that, that creeper over there. It was making me very uncomfortable. But, uh, let's see. Where's all that fish that I normally eat? Here's some... What? Oh, uh, yeah, I forgot you can place string now. Okay. Alright. Yeah, you could do that for, like, 20 updates. It, it doesn't really matter. But let's see. Alright. That's not good. The game is still kind of freezing. Oh, the zombies are burning up. Ha, 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 ha. That's, that's funny. Alright, let's see. Um, let's see, where's my sticks? My other piece of string. Let's make a fishing rod, and this is how you make it right. You do that, and then like that. Yes, there we go. Okay, fishing rod to repair my other one. I don't have any extra pork chop. I'm gonna have to cook that. Um, let me just keep that. And why don't I start cooking up this... Do I have anything cooking in any of these furnaces? Nope. Okay. 
in that case, let me put my sword back because I'm not gonna need it just yet. And let me let me cook this beef. Go ahead and cook that. Okay. Alright, there we go. Now here's this. And where's my anvil? My anvil is over in that room. Just right here, okay. That and that that repairs it like fully for only two? Wow, that's yeah, these things are pretty easy to repair. I didn't think you'd be too easy. I mean, this thing is like a god fishing rod. Never thought I'd ever see a god fishing rod, but there it is in its spot. And now that that has happened, now what I want to do is I want to brew all of my water breathing potions. So now that I have my 10 puffer fish, I can brew 10 sets of three water breathing potions. So that should be 30 potions. All right. So, I'm definitely going to need a lot more bottles than this. I just do that. And take these out and kind of prepare these. I think that's going to be an odd... Yeah, I'm going to need some more. But, you know what? That is okay. I'm going to go and get a ton of sand. And, you know what? I'm just going to record the whole thing. But I'm just going to, like, speed it up or something. So... Yeah, I, I'm gonna go to that desert over there. I should probably bring my sword with me in case, you know, creepers. I'm probably gonna need a new shovel, too. Dang it. Alright, let's see. Uh, where's my sticks? Yeah, let's just, uh, actually, no. Do that. Need a couple cobblestone from one of these chests. Or one, rather. Okay. And let me just do that and I am going to go get a crap ton of cobblestone so yeah prepare for fast you know what to be honest I think that is enough sand I don't know why I made an extra shovel I thought it was gonna break super quickly but you know I think that's honestly enough sand because I keep forgetting when you use like you know the three glass it actually makes three bottles. It doesn't make one for every three glass. I thought I would have to get, like... I only really need 30 bottles. I'll get more on my own time because I'm gonna brew, like, a lot of potions. You know, I don't obviously need only 30 at a time. I can make more. But uh, right for the, for the matter at hand right now, I only really need 30. So, and especially because it's going to take quite a while to cook all of this. Um, to be honest, this one doesn't need any fasting. So I'm just gonna... Um, and pause it. Okay, I'll be right back when this is all done. Okay, guys, all this glass is done cooking, and I actually realized I'm going to have one extra piece of glass, and my OCD is going to kill me, but, you know, I'm just going to have to deal with it. So this can divide into 15. 15. To be honest, I don't even have to. I could just, like, split in half or whatever. And there we go, and now I have one piece of glass. Get, get rid of this before I die. Any extra glass? No, sadly. Alright, so now I have 45 bottles, so now I can just fill them all up. And I'm not gonna fill them all up, actually. I'm just gonna fill up what I need to, so let me just do that. So that's, that's like that. And now I need 15, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So that should be 15 more water bottles. Let's put these all in these brewing stands. Oh, I need one more or something. I don't know why the like the counting is off. That's weird. Alright. Kinda lagged a little bit. Alright, so now that I have all the bottles set up, now I need to kinda collect some of this nether wart. Nether wart grows very quickly. It's, it's weird. It's very, it's so easy to grow. It's not a challenge at all to find it, except for this world, because usually it's like everywhere in the nether. I just could barely find it if you, uh, if you weren't, uh, oh no, that wasn't the last part. That was like a part before that. But let's see, now I gotta replant all of it, and it drops like a lot. Drops two, I think, for every full grown one. You see, it already starts growing. All right. Let's see, I should just stop explaining stuff that you probably already know about this game. But, you know, whatever. Um, alright, that's, that's a lot of nether wart. Okay, so let's, let's come back up here, and now I can start 
by, you know what I like to do? I always like to do that. Just so that I can just be like, ha, and ha. And just like that, just to make it a lot easier. Let me tell you, it's a lot easier on the, uh, the computer version, the Xbox version. You kind of have to, like, separate everything just with the analog stick, and it's kind of clumsy and weird. All right, so that's all that. I'm going to need one more, uh, I'm going to need three more pieces of redstone, actually, so just do that. And now, I'm going to brew up these, these puffer fish. Okay, I skipped a bunch of them. Don't know why. All right, that's a, that's a lot of dead puffer fish. All right, yes, we are going to make our water-breathing potions, and then I'm going to increase the time with the redstone. So just do this. And there we go. Now I just gotta wait. So, um, what I actually, uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna have to try to find a, uh, different recording software other than Loilo. Now, don't get me wrong. This is pretty good. It's very convenient. It's very simple to use. It's very easy. But the thing is, uh, you know, it's still kind of lagging a bit, especially when there's a lot of action happening. It's still, it still lags a lot, and um, that's not really my main problem. My, the, the file sizes are still, like, multiple gigabytes large, and honestly, it's, it's weird because it said it, it would make the file sizes a lot smaller, like, not so large, but it seems like they're still as large as fraps, and I think that could be a reason why it's still lagging. It's because it's still saving crap ton of memory to my drive, or, yeah, my, uh, my computer, and it's just, it's lagging a lot, so I'm gonna try to find some other ones. If not, I'll just stick, and also, like, you may notice the coloring is, like, off or something. It's very weird, uh, um, but yeah, I'll look at that later. All right now, I gotta put in the redstone, so let's, uh, let's do that. And, yeah, let's brew up this redstone. So I'll just worry about that, uh, on my own time. Did I get that one? No, I didn't. For now, let's just worry about brewing up these potions so we can go searching for an ocean temple. As you may have... As you may know, I stated in my, like, 1.8 update video, my review, that, um, I haven't found an ocean temple yet. So, this is gonna be my first time trying to find I don't know what their layout is, like, what they look like or anything. Um, so I'm just gonna have to find out for myself. Hopefully they're not too large. Hopefully they're kind of small, just like the other two temples. But, um, yeah, th this is already done. Alright, so there we go. Water breathing for eight minutes. And, let's see, 30 times, or, yeah, 30 times 30. Um, because it's 30 potions times 30 minutes. Let's see, that is... 900 minutes of water breathing. I, I'm not going to worry about dividing that out right now. But that is 900 minutes of water breathing. Just look at that. I can barely even bring most of them with me because look at this. It clogs up like all, all of that. So to be honest, I'm just going to save some of them. I'm going to put like half of them in here because I'm... Um, you know, I'm still gonna look for more potions later, or not potions, um, water temples, like in the, uh, yeah, ocean temples in the future. I'm gonna be exploring more in the future, obviously, but, um, I really only need, like, that much of them right now, so, um, yeah, that's... Alright, now that that's done, I brought up all these potions, I am actually going to go look for an ocean temple now. I don't really plan on doing anything else. Let me just check on this here. Uh, you know what, I'm, I'm sleep man that's scary monster what i hate that why does it do that i'm surrounded by wood like what are they gonna do like open up my door or something the, it, like, what the heck i can't even sleep because there's a spider they should like fix that they should fix that there's a spider there uh, I'm, i'll beat him down oh there's two spiders i see how it's gonna be can they, like, not see you over fences or something? Okay, I'm just not getting that. Okay, they can see you. Holy Jesus, the lag. Oh, my. Another reason is just that this computer is old and full of stuff on it, and it can barely run anything without it nearly crashing. But, you know, that's fine. I'm gonna get a new computer in the future sometime. Some Sometime. But just, just be patient. I'll try to make it work out for now, and until I get rich enough to purchase a better computer, 
I'm just gonna have to deal with this. But you know, that's fine. Let's just cut down all of this sugarcane so we can make another... I just broke that. That's that's kind of ticking me off. I'm just trying to break the sugarcane. But, um, yeah, all my wheat is done, too. I'm not gonna worry about that, though. I just want to try to see if I can make a quick bookshelf, or a book at least, right before I start going on my journey. Oh, and I just learned by playing the Xbox version that uh, horse armor doesn't break, so I can actually just put, uh, I can just put the diamond on. Look at that shiny blue armor, look at that. He's all, he's all decked out for battle. Well, let's see, let's just put this, like, in here or something, or let me put it with the other horse armor right there. I'm not gonna keep, like, the iron and gold, because I really don't need any, it just, it doesn't break. Um, actually, do I? Because I know if you, if a horse dies, I don't think it drops the, uh, thing. It's lagging. Um, you know, I'm just not gonna put it on right now. He's, he's just gonna have no armor right now. And, um, yeah, I'm pretty sure, uh, horse, or cow, uh, yeah, and animals mixed up. He doesn't have that many hearts. I, I thought, like, horses only had, like, a set amount. And then I learned that they can have a random amount. Usually it's, like, at least more than double of that. It's, like, the, the maximum is, like, double of what cow has. So, I'm not really going to trust him with that, uh, diamond armor right now. If cow dies, I'll just make a cow the second. I mean, I, I don't know doesn't matter but cow is a good horse so i'll try to keep him alive and if he can do me good like uh how like uh, however many times like however many adventures he goes on with me then i'll let him i'll, I'll promote him to a diamond armor status but for now let's just uh let's, let's create paper let me just three five six seven eight and there we go more paper okay now, do I have any leather? I don't think I do. I gotta go kill a cow or something out uh, in the in the backyard. So let's see. Do I have any books or anything? Or is this gonna be a new? I think this is gonna be a new bookshelf. Did I make another one? Yeah, I did make two. All right. I think that was on like two parts before. That wasn't the last part. But um, I'm still, I'm still okay. Let's just yeah. Let's let's go kill a cow. First, I gotta breed them before I kill one, obviously, otherwise I'm not gonna be able to make any more cows. Let's get the wheat. And, okay. Incest time. I uh, forgot the particles just don't show up because of Optifine. And, uh, I am aware that 1.8.3 came out. Alright, that did not make any leather, so no bookie this time. No bookie bookie this time. So, um, yeah, I am aware that 1.8.3 has been released, but they didn't make Optifine for it yet, so I'm just not gonna worry about it yet. I'm unclear of what it really did. I gotta kind of look up what exactly it did to help Minecraft, but, um, yeah, I'll just wait for them to make an, an Optifine of it, and then I'll use, so yeah, I'm just using 1.8.1, which is honestly not too much different, probably. They probably didn't do anything. They probably just made another version because we were waiting for one for so long. And yes, they did skip two. I think that's because they never released two, probably. They were like, we didn't do enough. So, let's see. Now I'm going to go on my my trip. Actually, what I want to do, I want to bring my diamond sword with me, because I don't know how powerful the guardians are. And it's okay, I have like 34 extra diamonds. If I lose this one, it'll be fine. It doesn't have any enchantments on it or anything, so really, it's not going to matter much if I, if I die or not. Uh, obviously, I'm never gonna bring my diamond armor with me, because I don't know what to expect. I'll only bring my diamond armor when I go on, uh, that amazing, like, five-part long journey, ten parts maybe, across the whole world, and, um, also if I fight the Ender Dragon. That's, like, my ultimate goal. I just wanna, like, kill the Ender Dragon. I mean, who doesn't want to do that legitimately, put that kind of challenge on themselves like that. So let's see, what I actually want to do is... Do I have any other iron pickaxes I could just combine with this to, um... No. But, uh, I don't even know if I'm really gonna need my pickaxe. I'm just going to bring it with me. Always bring a stack of blocks or, or so, just in case, you know, something bad happens. You always want to be prepared for emergencies. And, uh, I got my potions. 
And is that really all I need? Obviously, I'm not bringing a horse with me or a cow with me. I keep, like, when you name an animal after another animal, it starts to get a little confusing on your mind. But, you know, it's fine. I'm not going to bring any animals with me. Just, I think that's really all I need. Oh, yes, my map. I need my map, obviously. I do not want to get lost in this world. That would be a tragedy. Let's see. So, yeah, I'm just going to look at that ocean that was over there past the desert so um i don't know if i want to speed this up at all but um i'm just gonna make my way to the ocean and yeah i'm pretty sure they appear at the bottom of the ocean so i'm just gonna look around there is that a savannah that's a savannah over there and that's an africa biome that's what i call it. it's an africa biome because it's it's africa it is a savannah it's africa so um yeah there's an ocean i believe it's an ocean at least and not giant lake yeah there's an ocean over there and uh what is that that is actually a pretty pretty sweet um thing a natural structure let's see probably should have brought even more than a stack of fish to be honest i'm probably gonna go through this really quickly but you know whatever i'm just gonna have to deal with it for now um probably should have brought like a fishing rod in case i need to catch some more fish but that would take too long so you know it doesn't matter here's an ocean right over here i'm just gonna try not to jump uh jump too much and you can't lose hunger from swimming i think i'm gonna be swimming the whole time obviously so um i don't i don't know Ooh, uh yeah 20 fps it's 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 not too good man but you know um let's see that's it's a huge ocean. I, I don't know if they produce light or anything to indicate where they are, but I'm just gonna have to kind of play with this right now and hope for the best. So I think I am going to actually speed this up a little bit because I'm not too sure whether or not this game is gonna want to be nice to me or anything. It's probably gonna take like at least 10 minutes to find one if not even finding one at all. I just kind of broke English there, but you know. All right, time to go fast. Oh, hey, is that one over there, or is that just a, uh, a mound of sand? I think that's just, I think that's just a mound of sand. That, that is not one. I'm, I'm sorry, everybody. I kind of misinterpreted it. I'm, I'm sorry. Looks very suspicious. No, that's just a hill. Okay. an ocean temple is that no never mind I'm, I'm stupid i'm stupid that's just that's just andesite i'm sorry i'm stupid i saw the crack in the ground i thought it was something i'm i'm sorry i was an idiot i i'm terribly sorry <laughs> off in the distance i'm not sure how little that thing is exactly but that definitely looks like an ocean temple to me it actually looks like a lost atlantis i thought it was just kind of like a jungle temple uh, a jungle temple like uh like a small little thing with no real like design or anything just kind of buried underneath the sand i didn't think it was like this lost atlantis sort of thing like that big but wow, that's actually very prominent. I thought it would take forever for me to try to, uh, to, like, find one. Because I thought they're actually, like, buried kind of underneath. Kind of like a dungeon. Or like a pyramid. You know how they kind of get, like, buried in the sand. Dang. That is... That's crazy. Let's, let's get up closer and discover this National Geographic... What just happened? 
snap. Oh, oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. Okay, alright, alright. It's just, it's just lagging. Alright. Alright, alright. So your breath does regenerate when you, uh... Okay, there it is. Your breath does regenerate when you use one, does it? Or do you have to, like, go back to the air? The air is right here. I didn't think they were, like, that far above the ground. Like, they're, like, almost at the surface. You could see them from the surface. That's ridiculous. Alright, it's not too far, actually. I thought I would have to, like, go across this entire map. I just don't want to explore any of the land, you know. I'm gonna save that for my giant exploratory journey. I, I don't know what I was going from there. But, um, yeah, this is crazy. I'm gonna harvest so much stuff from this. Probably should have actually brought a full pickaxe. Whoa, there are guardians everywhere. Let's prepare for battle. Actually, we have full hunger. Did I even eat that yet? It's just kind of laggy. That is not good, actually. I'm gonna have to fight these guys in the middle of lag. Let's see, so do these even have, like, any rooms to really explore? They do. You can go in them like that. Whoa! Whoa! Chill down there, buddy. Chill. Chill. Don't don't start your shooting your lasers at me, no. Alright, let's break these. Holy Jesus. Can we even break those? How do you break these? I'm not gonna worry about that right now. I'm just gonna have to run away from these lasers, yo. Isn't there like a boss, like a king guardian or something? I'm- I'm in for something. They are just shooting lasers at me! I didn't think- I thought they like actually swam at you and tried to attack- So yeah, there are no air pockets in this. You do have to use the water potions. Dang, I thought like- Holy jeez, I thought they like tried to swim at you- Try to swim at you really fast. And then you'd have to kind of like fend them off. Honestly, that kind of makes it a little bit more predictable and easier. I didn't think they're gonna shoot lasers. I don't know what you need to break those. Maybe a diamond pickaxe or something? I don't know. Well, let's see. Are there, like, any other rooms that we can explore or anything? There's just, like, a wall here. That was crazy, man. I don't even... Oh, there's more rooms in here. Okay. Dang, this is actually really... I, I have never... Let me tell you, I've never thoroughly explored a Minecraft ocean. It's actually, like, really fun. It's like It's like a biome in its own. It's... It's crazy, like, with all the crevices and everything, it's... It almost feels like real life. Like, it's really cool. I, I know there's, like, sponge rooms and stuff where you can harvest natural sponge. Let's try to find that. All I'm seeing right here are just these light rooms, though. Is there any, like, uh... So, I think we're actually, like, in the pillars. Like, you can go in each pillar on the outside. I'm gonna have to continue this into the next episode. Yo. Let's kill this thing. Can we even kill it? Okay, yeah, yeah, there we go, there we go. Is it, is it dead? Is it dead? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? It's out there, isn't it? Alright, well, that's the way out. Yeah, that's the way, this is the way I came from. Alright then. Let's come, uh... So there's like two ways to go. Huh. It's up there. Let's just, let's just try this. That's just another light room, okay. This is really fun, man. I've never seen one of these before. This is cool. Like, really? There was another room down here. I'm just gonna check this. Or no, that wasn't it. Yo. This guardian, though. I think it was this, right? This is the room? Yeah, here's a room in here, but like, what's this? Oh, you stupid guardian. Whoa. Whoa. Quit your shooting, you lasers. This is stupid. Holy Jesus. Alright, yes, you die, guardian. Alright, got some guardian. What are they called? Prismarine shards, alright. Yeah, that's right, this is all made of prismarine. Okay. Um, nothing in here, I guess, is just more lights. I wonder what kind of loot you can get out of this. I like how the sea lanterns, it kind of like makes your view like all blue, like with the blue haze. It's cool, alright, what's up here? It's gotta be something. I mean, come on. Yo. Is this just like all of it or something? Like, this is crazy. Now we're getting a lot of guardians. Man, this is insane. It's lagging again very profusely. Okay. I'm not sure if you can lag profusely, but you can now. Alright, alright. Quit yo.
Quit your lasers, you guardian. Is it making any noises? I can't. I kind of turned the volume down so that doesn't do that thing. Well, let's see. Yeah, that's right. Beat them down. Oh, jeez. Okay. All right. All right. All right. That's enough, guardian. It's enough. These things are crazy, man. All right. Definitely need my diamond sword. It still takes them like five hits with this thing to kill them. This is like all of the thing. This is like really crazy. I'm gonna have a lot to explore. Let me tell you, I'm gonna have a hard time getting out of this thing. That's for sure. Holy Jesus. Does this game just do that to you? That is insane. Thankfully I have my volume down. It's like turned into a horror game or something. I'm not ready for that stuff. Let's see. I, I don't don't force that kind of stuff upon it's the King Guardian. It's the King Guy. I didn't realize he was like white. Alright. Is there like any rooms that you can loot before you kill the King Guardian? Like anything at all? Or is it just a bunch of these rooms with like nothing in them other than these lights? Alright, well the video I, I know I'm like going to fast forward at least like 10 minutes of it, but um, I think it's at a good portion now where I can kind of take a break, and we're going to continue this on the next part. This is really crazy, man. I love this so far. All right, so yeah, I think that does it for this part. On the next part, we are going to continue exploring this ocean temple and try, try to fight the King Guardian. I'm, I'm not sure if I'm really going to do that yet. We'll, we'll see about it. So he doesn't really have a boss bar, does he? Or do you have to, like, enter the room for it to happen? That is crazy, man. I can't wait for this. So, yeah, that's it for this part. So don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed watching this video and subscribe to stay updated for more Minecraft survival. That is all for now. Twenty one.